Hi everyone, I'm Elijah Jadi. Welcome to Music Greatness. This is Urban, and for today's lesson, we have That Girl by Stevie Wonder. It sounds just like this. So, for this first part, I'm going to break down the section of the intro. We're playing here in the key of G sharp minor. And for the intro, we're starting with A sharp minor 7 add 11. I'm playing A sharp on my left, G sharp and D sharp, right hand, with a grace note, C sharp going up on D sharp. After that, D sharp 7, sharp 9, octave D sharp, G, C sharp, and F sharp. And then I have this G sharp minor 9, G sharp on the left, F sharp, A sharp, B, and D sharp on top. Then I'm going to take down this note by a half step and play G sharp minus 6 at 9 so F A sharp B D sharp and after that E major 7 with G sharp on the bass so now for the right hand E G sharp B and D sharp after that I'm playing C sharp minus 7 C sharp on the left, E, G sharp and B, then E major 7, playing octave E, G sharp, B and D sharp, and finally D sharp minus 7, octave D sharp, F sharp, A sharp and C sharp. Okay, let's recap from the top. A sharp minus 7 at 11, going up a fourth on D sharp 7 sharp 9, and after that, G sharp minus 9, G sharp 6, G sharp minus 6 at 9, E major 7 over G sharp, C sharp minus 7, E major 7, Finally, D sharp minus 7. Okay, here's the intro. Okay, we're starting with a melody line on the right hand G sharp, A sharp, B, and then C sharp, and after that, play A sharp minor with the grace note, then play one C sharp, and after that D sharp 7, sharp 9, followed by E on your right hand. Okay, let's continue. So, here, for the red hand, what we're going to do is play G sharp minor 9 for one measure, and then G sharp minor 6, one measure, E measure 7, and then we have C sharp minor 7, going up on E measure 7, and after that, we're playing twice D sharp minor 7. 1, 2, 3, 4. 
two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, and four. That's for the red hand. Now for the left, we're playing this bass line. We have F sharp going up on G sharp. And then G sharp again, but played one octave lower. Okay. And playing that note, we're starting the pattern on the right hand. Okay. Then again, F sharp, G sharp. Then G sharp minus six at nine. Playing G sharp down here three times. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. So we're going to repeat this movement a lot. F sharp, G sharp, then G sharp down here. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. So I played again the movement and the second time playing G sharp I played E major 7 on my right hand. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, and one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Okay, as you can see, after playing E major 7 on my right hand, I played again F sharp, G sharp, G sharp, then F sharp, G sharp, and after that, C sharp minus 7, E, and D sharp minus 7 twice. 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, and 2, and 3, and 4. After that, I'm going to repeat the same thing. So from the top, two, three, four, and one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, and four. Three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, and four. So, on the very last time playing the progression, the chord progression of the intro, after playing twice D sharp minus seven, we're not going to replay the bass line movement. We're simply Going to play G sharp minor 9 with G sharp F sharp on the left, A sharp B, and D sharp right hand. Like this. Okay, once again, here's the intro slow tempo. Here it is again at full speed. That's all for this first part. For the rest of the song, please head over to musicgreatness.com. 
As always, thank you for watching. If you love the content, leave a like, leave a comment, and also don't forget to subscribe. Until then, see you guys next week for another Urban. Oh,